Nuclear reactors on board the USS Enterprise unleashed immense heat, turning water into high-pressure steam. Rushing through the turbines, the steam spun their blades at incredible speed. That rotation passed through a series of gears, generating the force needed to drive a 120-meter-long shaft connected to a massive propeller. Together with three other propellers, they could push 91,000 tons of steel through the ocean at over 55 kilometers per hour. This groundbreaking engineering made the USS Enterprise the world's first nuclear-powered aircraft carrier. To shield the crew from deadly radiation, engineers surrounded each reactor with tons of lead. With eight reactors on board, that meant enormous weight concentrated midship. In rough seas, this could have caused the keel to buckle, so they reinforced it with a honeycomb of steel cells, distributing the load across the entire hull. In November 1961, the USS Enterprise took to the sea. It wasn't just a ship, it was the largest aircraft carrier ever built and the most powerful mobile energy facility on Earth.